all right guys now you can see this is a bank nifty and the four hour chart and you can see as we uh, discussed yesterday here was Fibonacci extension around 161 percent from this area and here exactly resistant are there and uh, somewhere here was our resistance zone but uh, they have failed to break this area so now you can see the price are not able to sustain above this zone have you seen and again price uh, trying to drop down from this area from this area right now question is that can we buy here or can i sell here in this area so most of the people are uh, start selling in this area by using this candlestick pattern so what type of candlestick pattern we have seen here so we have seen this was bullish candle right followed by a smaller candle which is called inside bar and below this inside bar people are start selling so now according to projection method we have seen the price is creating higher high higher low and the higher high where was the resistance because we know a price never goes like a rocket right always goes like a wave right giving a retracement somewhere they are finding resistant resistant somewhere support and again push up support push up resistant again drop down like that so now we have seen some resistant other similarly here and the price is trying to drop down from this area now question is that where is the supporting line where we can enter for the buy so let's check it here so according to the moving average 200 and uh, why i'm using right now 200 moving average so if you want to see according to the pbs market behavior price was dropped down from moving average 200 exponential right have you seen price again drop down from this area now this line are uh, acting uh, as a support now previously we can see that was uh, was acting as a resistance and after that price dropped down and uh, uh, now you can see they broke here and the uh, price again trying to drop down now it's becoming a support right so let me draw a supporting line by using this method and now we have seen some here support are there exactly 200 moving average are there and uh, similarly we have seen if you want to see previous market behavior here we have seen multiple rejection now question is that here we have seen according to this neckline have you seen this neckline right i told this is neckline when they will break this level so we'll go for like that buy right according to this neckline this is a little more higher point so now i'm going to draw a trend zone right so just a minute Uh, it is called supporting zone now i want to connect this higher point here and a lower point here by connecting this higher point and a lower point have you seen just a minute okay i just connected both of them right now we have seen this is called supporting zone right all right so we have seen supporting zone so you can draw like that then it comes to it comes to properly and we have seen many support and resistance in this area have you seen it right all right so now we have seen here multiple rejection area and the neckline here 200 moving average so we have seen this is a support line now we have seen this is a bearish candlestick pattern and bearish uh, candlestick pattern are forming and we are targeting toward this area now question is that uh, can i buy suddenly when price will reach that area no we will uh, wait we will wait for a candlestick pattern above this supporting zone here above this supporting zone some candlestick pattern right so now we can see according to price action higher high higher low higher high and waiting for next higher low now let's check it we have seen this lower point and a higher point this is a wave right let me check it how uh, Fibonacci, uh, Fibonacci extension are working like that right so let me show you 
Now we have seen here in this zone, uh, here uh, this is wave. Now we have seen first Fibonacci retracement zone 23 percent here, and the next we have seen exactly 38 percent up placing. So it is forming a strong support. Right? Let's check it now. Let me remove. We have seen our uh, a buy entry because we have seen somewhere here buy entry above this area, right? And uh, target will be somewhere here. Okay. Now let's check it in a small time frame, like uh, 15 minutes for our entry and exit. Have you seen exactly? We have seen this zone are uh, exactly forming above uh, 200 moving average so similarly we have seen price was bouncing from here uh, moving average uh, 200 right it's rejecting from this area so after that price is following moving average 20 right 20 and after that they broke this 20 level and later they broke this uh, 50 now targeting toward uh, 50 moving average right sorry 200 moving average right so in that area we are looking for buy opportunity uh, by using candlestick pattern right candlestick we are looking for a proper candlestick pattern in this area and uh, now you can see you can see here how many points are there from this point to this point let me check it once from this point to this point so almost 200 points are there and the most of the people are entering here for the sell they will give a little more profit and again reverse back from this area they are doing big mistake right always avoid that big mistake and for the sword you just wait to break this uh, level leave it that point how many point are 200 300 whatever don't try to catch every point right don't try right very difficult you can't catch every point so always find out the proper uh, entry and exit exit point which is called high probability trade now we have seen two high probability trade let me tell you one buy above this supporting zone by using some technical tools basically i use candlestick pattern like here hammer pattern inside bar engulfing pattern so if you want to know more uh, uh, details about that candlestick pattern and behavior you just uh, go to my website which is called hornprofit.com and read their uh, candlestick pattern. I read properly, right? Uh, everything. So we are looking for buy opportunity above this area by using candlestick pattern, right? Okay. One, uh, this is one, uh, what call high probability trade, right? For the buy. And for the sell, we are looking for here right we are looking for after breaking this area and when price will retrace and at that time some resistance level will be like that and same same method we will use there candlestick pattern very candlestick pattern and after that we will enter here for the sell so let's check it if they break this zone how it should look like that so suppose if price break this zone in this area if you want to enter for the sell, so where is our target? So our target will be somewhere here. So I think uh, today it is not uh, possible to break this area. So I think they will be just like that, right? So by the way, if you want to enter for the buy, you just always wait for proper anti signal, right? So I hope you enjoy this video. If you like this video, Please like and subscribe. And for the evening session, you just subscribe my another YouTube channel, uh, whose link is already given in this uh, below description. Thanks for watching.